It is one of the most disturbing murder cases in Hillsborough County history. A woman, her two children, and the family dog were beheaded and mutilated. Her boyfriend, Edward Covington, is now on trial for killing them. News Channelist Melanie Michael is covering that trial for us. She is joining us now live. So what did you see and hear in court today, Mel? Hey, Keith, good evening to you. Well, it was May 2008, and I was covering the story that day. We had no idea what went on inside that house, but now the details are coming out. And I have to warn you and all of our viewers tonight, they are very graphic. Some of the details too disturbing to talk about on television. It was a house of horrors. Blood was everywhere on every surface of this mobile home. Body parts all over the living room. Knives and hammers left on the floor. Tools of a madman. The medical examiner called it rage, pure rage. And Edward Covington admits he killed them all and then shoved bird seed and dog food in their open wounds. He told detectives that he used a bread knife and quote, it went through the chest cavity. Um, it's scary to say, but almost like carving a pig, a hog. So what would drive a man to such madness? Lisa Freiberg, her daughter Savannah, her son Zachary, and their German Shepherd Duke were brutalized. Defense attorneys claim their client is crazy. At the time of the crime that Mr. Covington was insane, very, very insane. There was blood literally in every room, the walls, the floors, the furniture. Covington's defense, not guilty by reason of insanity, as his parents sit on one side of the courtroom and Lisa's on the other. The couple had only been dating a few months after they met online. Edward Covington suffers from extreme mental illness. His attorney tells aid on your side and was not in his right mind when he beheaded and mutilated those bodies. And the trial continues tomorrow, and it's shaping up to be a very emotional day, Keith, as Lisa Freiberg's mother, who discovered the bodies, is scheduled to testify, and we will be there. Yeah, sickening details for sure. Thank you. Melanie Michael reporting live in Tampa.